Students who graduate community college with an Associate of Applied Science degree have the opportunity to go straight into the workforce and continue moving up the ladder at Mississippi State University branch in Meridian. There was a need that was pointed out to our Building Construction Science program in Starkville of students graduating from career tech programs, which are very needed, to come out and work in the construction industry and, um, and businesses like that, to then be able to be moved into project foreman and that type of position. Even if you received your associate's degree years ago, this MSU program can benefit you today. I'm seeing students that are transferring straight from the program. I'm seeing um, community college instructors coming into the program. I'm seeing those that are already in places, um, you know, other businesses that already have positions and those places have identified, hey, we want you to, to be able to advance, go finish that bachelor's degree. Harold Hollingsworth is an HVAC instructor at East Central Community College. He is currently enrolled in MSU's Trade Supervision Program and says something like this has been greatly needed. The biggest problem we had was when a student did career technical, that's, thought, that, that's all they thought they could do. Limiting that education has, has put a hindrance on us. Uh, now with this program like that we're in right now with trade supervision, that's allowing those of, like me that are that are older students that were working in the field that wanted to move into the office position to give them that opportunity. When we put this together, we did so knowing that this is going to be a working student that um, is just trying to advance a little bit. So we're offering those evening classes, we're offering um, hybrid type classes, even some online classes to help them juggle all of those responsibilities. Hollingsworth says there is a dire need for skilled tradesmen right now, and employers are desperate to fill the positions. I've got several contractors that I deal with that are specifically HVAC and electrical. Uh, I had one call me last week uh, begging me for students to go to work. Even with everything that happened with COVID, with everything that's happened with, with inflations, construction hasn't stopped. It's still there, it's still going on, and they don't have the qualified people to do the jobs. The opportunities for you to go to work and make money uh, are, are, I mean, they're astronomical. I said, I, I can throw a stone from here and hit somebody that's looking for somebody to go to work. Skill to Work is a Twin States News Initiative brought to you by our community partners.